An Oregon marital settlement agreement is a divorce tool by which a married couple settles certain matters relating to the dissolution of their marriage. In the document, the spouses can determine how their shared property, assets, debts, and child custody, if any, will be dispersed post-divorce. These types of documents are often not required by the courts, but they can speed up the divorce proceedings substantially in some instances. Let's take a deeper look at settlement contracts and their functions, as well as some legal requirements in Oregon for divorce. We're eForms, the world's biggest database of legal documents. Make sure to watch to the end of this video where we'll give you a link to where you can make your own marital settlement agreement online, potentially saving you thousands of dollars during the divorce process. With that, let's begin by discussing exactly what is a marital settlement agreement. A marital or divorce settlement agreement records all terms and conditions that will govern a married couple's impending divorce and life after the dissolution of their marriage. Among its many functions, the contract divides property and determines if any of the spouses must provide alimony or child support payments to the other. Now, creating a formal and written settlement comes with several common benefits. For instance, the document can avoid multiple contested trials in circuit court, allows the couple to divide their shared or marital assets such as real property, contains the express written consent of both spouses, can be kept as evidence in case any legal disputes arise, and specifies any custody arrangement, whether joint or sole custody. If and when both spouses see eye to eye on terms, they may draft a deal and effectively bypass extended hearings in court and even legal fees that come with hiring a divorce attorney. Of course, some divorces are more comprehensive than others, and the couple perhaps may not be able to reach an accord without mediation or legal representation. Both spouses should communicate openly to determine if a settlement is foreseeable. Now, let's review some of the legal requirements in Oregon. Oregon is one of the 41 states that have adopted equitable distribution laws. Equitable distribution is the fair dispersion of assets, meaning that the distribution is not necessarily divided up equally. Essentially, distributions are left to the discretion of a district judge who will separate property based on equitable law if and when the spouses are unable to reach a settlement before a trial or face a heavily contested divorce. When applying equitable distribution, the courts take into account the duration of the marriage, what each spouse paid for, employability of each spouse, assets and debts of each spouse or combined, and sources of income and amount. Nevertheless, a settlement can avoid such distributions by the courts, that is, both spouses can split their shared property in half if they are so inclined, or if they can arrange any other type of divide, all while using the agreement as proof that they're on the same page. Still, even then, a judge must approve the settlement. Judges may request amendments to the contract if they find unfair or unjust terms within the settlement. And finally, state residency plays a vital role in filing for divorce, particularly one requirement. At least one spouse must have lived in the state for six months prior to either party filing a divorce action. Following the divorce action accordingly and creating a predetermined settlement can accelerate the process, and it may take anywhere from two to six weeks. Each spouse should ensure that they do their part in order to expedite the process while still protecting their assets. We're eForms, the largest database of legal documents. We have created an expansive and state-specific template that covers every last detail of the Oregon Marital Settlement Agreement. To get this official template that can be used to file for divorce in your local circuit court, simply click on the link below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more daily videos.